Quickly, what are my obligations to enjoy pastoral ministry? I'll run it fast. Number one, receive the pastor. Matthew chapter 10, verses 40 to 41. He that receives, a, receives you, receives me. He that receiveth you, receives him that sent me. He that receives a prophet, in the name of a prophet, shall receive a prophet's reward. So you must receive your pastor. How do you receive him? Open up your heart. Praise the Lord. Open your heart. Open what? Open what? That's how you receive a pastor. Don't just open the door. Open the heart. There are so many people that open doors to their homes and their hearts are closed. There are people that open up their businesses to the pastor but their hearts are closed. That's not how to receive a pastor. You receive a pastor, pastoral ministry, by opening up your heart. And when you receive them, there is flow of grace. The same grace that is upon his servants. I see the same grace manifesting on your life in the name of Jesus Christ. Praise the Lord. No matter how anointed a man of God or a woman of God may be, as long as your heart is closed, they may never be a blessing to you. There are so many people that we think, we assume they are not anointed. Ah, that man is not, he's not on fire. No. No. It's your heart that is closed. You understand? The moment your heart opens up, you discover that the flow of grace will find expression in your life. So the heart mostly is the issue and the heart has to be opened. I pray that God today opens your heart in Jesus' name.